when a woman releases there is this water that comes out from the woman's body that water it brings this prosperity into the life of a man that is faithful to that woman and that woman is faithful to you that is why as a man never go in between of the lady of a woman without knowing that lady properly you don't just see a woman and start knocking a woman because that water alone can bring bad luck to you at the same time it can bring good luck to you it's power in the body of a woman because a woman can reproduce a woman can give birth to a baby that look exactly like you as a man there is power that god has given to a woman that is why the bible made us to understand that man you should what treat your woman well so that your prayer will not be hindered and the bible also said men love your wife love your woman that does not mean that you must marry the person before you love the woman the Bible did not say love your wife, love your woman. So any woman that you are with, identify as your woman. So you have to treat her well, love her, so that that water that is coming out from the body of the woman will not bring hindrance to your life. Rather, it will bring prosperity. That is why you see some men, once they start going with one particular woman, their life will be transfigured all of a sudden. They will be glowing in wet, like glowing in wet, growing in wet day by day. Their life will be speed. Everything will be working out from them. Because they are faithful to that woman and the woman is faithful to them. So that is one thing as a man you need to know before you go in between of a woman. For you as a man, be very sensitive and be careful with the type of woman you involve into your life. So if you evolve any hard woman into your life, your life will be any hard. So before you go in between of a woman, make sure you are so calculative and know the type of woman that you go in between with, with your in between of your leg. Don't knocking is a good thing, but never knock any hard. Once you start knocking any hard, your life will be like this. It will be upside down. Your life will never be straightforward. The second water that comes out from a woman is the water from the eye. Never allow your woman to be crying every time. Allow the tears that come out from your woman. Let it be more of joy than the tears of sorrow. Because the more your woman start crying, the more causes come to your life. The Bible already made it clear that you should what? You should what? Treat your woman well so that your prayer will not be hindered. So there is more power that God has dedicated to women. That if I see women are dream, you treat your woman properly. And the woman self will respect you. Because what comes in a relationship or marriage is respect. Once a woman is respecting you, no matter how hard your heart is, you must love that woman. Because respect, God already made it that women should respect their husband. Respect their men. Why the men should love the woman? Because it's, it's already been done. Like He knows that women are easy to love than the men. The more your woman gives you respect, the more the love grow day by day. That is why you see some women that with some men because the women regard the men treated the men well the men are progressing in their life in their career in everything that they are doing because they are with the right woman so never make mistake to enter the wrong woman because the wrong woman will always bring you down no matter how hard your heart is the wrong woman will always bring you down so that is why you should never allow your woman to tear tears of sorrow than tears of joy. Let the joy come soon. Let her share more tears of joy. Like seeing you as a man. Like, oh, I'm so happy to be with you. I'm so lucky to have this kind of man in my life. Let, her, let it be her dream. Let it be her song every day. Like praising you, honoring you, respecting you as a man. You'll be so proud of yourself because you will be so happy for the rest of your life. The third water that comes out from a woman is the water of the mouth. Never allow your mouth to kiss a woman that is angry with you. A woman that you know that she's so bitter about you. A woman that you know that she does not like you. Never allow it. Because once you allow your mouth to be kissing the woman that hates you, your life will be going down. I'm telling you the reality. A woman that has a happy mind with you, you will always progress once you kiss that woman. Once that woman comes into your life, your life will be progressive. But a woman that does not like you, 
Every anytime you kiss that woman, things will start changing for you. So as a man, make sure before you use your mouth to kiss any woman or use your mouth to eat the punani of a woman, make sure you know that that woman is truly yours. Or that woman is the right woman for you. If not, you are spoiling things for yourself. Because this water is so powerful. And changing the speed of a woman with yours is so powerful than you think. It's not just lip to lip. There is more to read. Because imagine you kissing a woman. What brings the sweetness of it? It's the joy that is in your mind that you kissing the woman. The memory that this is the, your love of your life. So once you are kissing that kind of person that does not care about you, you are bringing Hindra to yourself. So once you know that your woman is not happy, take for instance, the day you are angry with your woman and you went to work, what will happen in that day? Your day will not be bright. Your day will not be beautiful. So look at that and calculate the days that you are with your woman and she's so happy with you. She will even bless you before you go out to your workplace. That day will be so blessed. That day will be full of joy. Your heart will be so happy. You'll be so proud of yourself because you will do exploit that day. So that is one thing you need to know as a man. Never exchange your mind anyhow. Because the more you exchange it anyhow, the more your life becomes anyhow. Let me tell you something. If you are faithful to your woman and your woman is faithful to you, if you knock your woman, hmm? And you, you put your mouth and eat the punani of a woman. Eat it well as a man. Don't look at it like, oh, I'm this. No, it's yours. A other woman is yours. Eat it properly. There is more to it. You don't know what you are missing if you are not the type that knock the woman properly. Because as time will come, you will not have the energy to knock well. So now that you have the energy to knock, Make sure you enjoy it to the fullness as far you are with the right person. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, don't forget to share, don't forget to press the notification bell. Whenever we upload a new video, you can get all our uploads. See you guys in our next video.